So uh, this field of robotic partial nephrectomy is new. So it's evolving. And with that, there's a learning curve. So number one is the surgeon's comfort. You need to be very, comf very comfortable with this kind of surgery. It's vascular, it can bleed, and you have a time-sensitive procedure. You clamp the blood vessels to the kidney and the clock start ticking. So you need to be very careful. And that's why the indication started to be at a very modest way, the smaller tumors. Then we became experienced, so we started doing complex procedures. I think at this time, at least in our center, I would say any kidney tumor that is small and localized, that is a good candidate for open partial, will be a good candidate for robotic partial. I don't see times where I would say I will do this open. There was one last frontier that we can do only open and that was cooling the kidney inside the body. We used to put ice slush in open but cumbersome to do robotically. So whenever really you want to cool the kidney to decrease the metabolism so that the impact of clamping is negligible compared to the warm ischemia, uh, we used to put ice. But recently, over the last four years, uh, our team was able to effectively describe a cheap and reproducible way of adding the ice inside the patient through a robot port and duplicate what we have in open. So at this point, I'm comfortable saying that uh, almost any case that can be done as an open partial, we can do it robotically.